stuff in this boat no absolutely not look at this we're back the boat in now stay tuned we'll see you on the water We are on the water now, headed out to the spot. I think we're gonna do like a three mile run today. Just a quick little jog across the lake here and it shouldn't take too much time, maybe 10, 10 minutes or so. But uh, yeah, we are chain of lakes today, a couple different lakes we're gonna go to and we'll just see what happens. Probably gonna be fishing a little deeper than normal. It's still pretty cold, so you never know. Can't catch them from the couch. Let's start ripping. We've made it. We're gonna start with the deep diving jerk. Uh, actually, it's just a deep diving crankbait. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. We're gonna fish some deeper spots, probably like eight to 12 feet. Let's hopefully rip some lips. Let's go. Fifty-two point seven degree water temperature, and let me tell you, it is cold outside. I would be shocked if it's fifty degrees outside today. Very cold. There's one. I didn't even know I had one. There you go, first one. Hell yeah. There's a whole school of them down there of something. Crappie, perch, something. I was looking at those. First one. Not bad, little pounder. No need to keep him out too long. Back in he goes. Okay, one fish down. Um, unfortunately, it wasn't huge, but Caught it on the lip. Actually, it's not a lipless. This is a deep diving crankbait, obviously. I think that's the second time today I've had trouble saying it, but one fish down. I did have one other really cool follow. I seen a muskie. I was sight fishing for bass, trying to find some up shallow to see if there was anything. There's really no bass, but I seen one muskie, and so I threw this um, little crankbait like one inch off of his nose. Almost snagged him, honestly, and he turned on it like a rocket and followed it to the boat. I'm gonna try to put that footage in, but I don't know if, if you can see through the water very well. Looked like a mid, mid 30, 35, something like that. Pretty nice musky, but uh, it, it would have really changed the day for sure. That would have been incredible. So we're gonna go back to bass fishing for another hour or so, see if we can find one more, at least maybe wrap it up with two, two fish for the day. 
Uh-oh, about to hit the dock. Hit the dock. All right, back to bass fishing. This is a fun bait too because there's so many different ways to retrieve it. You can troll with this thing. You can throw it out and reel it in, just super simple. And then you can almost work it like a jerk bait if you want to. You can throw some pops in there and it really gets it uh, kind of just going crazy down underneath the water. It also can send you straight into the weeds. But it's a cool bait. Just one fish from over here. We're gonna scoot around a little bit, see if we can find some other sections that maybe we can hit some fish out of there. We might hit the spot. We caught the fish on the way out, but otherwise we'll see at the next spot. Don't know where I'm going yet. We're just gonna just gonna stroll around till we find something we like. Well, after seeing that musky, I'm back in the musky spot. We're gonna see if we can catch him on rod and reel. I was so close a little bit ago with the crankbait, but there's probably no chance of me actually landing it. No leader where this I've got a, it's either 80 or 100 pound monofilament leader. So we're gonna cast around for about a half an hour in this point. See if we can do something. No muskies on that point, unfortunately. No muskies on the point. No muskies on the point. We're heading out to another spot, spot number three or four now. Back to bass fishing, Let's see what happens. starting to go down probably got about another hour of light had a 15 minute run back to the dock but i hope you guys enjoyed this little video it was a fun day you know we kind of just went back and forth between largemouth and musky neither one of them is really super active but you know you can't catch them from from the house so we just come out here and we just see what we can do so uh, it was a lot of fun but we'll catch you on the next episode thanks for watching guys peace